Well, my name is Robert Dean Steele, and uh, we're heading into 2015 very shortly. And, of course, the question that we all ask is, what does next year going to hold? Is it going to be more of the same? Or is there something new and exciting coming my way? Of course, with a brand new year, we always feel this is, is, a, is a time of a brand new start. I know when I go into every year, I'm thinking about God what would be this year so different for me? What are you going to do in 2015 that you didn't do in 2014? What are you going to do in 2016 that you didn't do in 2015? Well, you know, God has a plan for every single day. In fact, the Bible says that the steps of a good man or a good woman are ordered by the Lord. Are you letting the Lord order your steps? Are you sitting there speculating today? Lord, what do you want to do through my life today? In my life today, Lord, I want you to be glorified. That's the approach that we should be taking. Lord, I just want to be an instrument. I want to be in the right place at the right time, doing the right thing for the right reason. Lord, I want to be your instrument of blessing. I want to bless those and encourage those and inspire those that are in my world because you are my inspiration. You are the one who guides my life and directs me through this situation. 2015, I believe, is going to be a very exciting year. I believe it's going to be a time of revival and breakthrough. I believe that God is going to do mighty things in the nation of Canada, in the city in which I live, which is St. Albert. I believe He's going to move by His Spirit. I believe He's going to move in the church that I pastor. I believe that when I get on the radio in 2015, when I get back from Japan, I believe that God's going to use me to speak a rhema word, a new word into people's lives. You know why I have that expectation? Because I serve a great God. And I know that He has great things in store for us. In fact, that's what He says. I have a plan, I have a hope, and I have a future for you today. Jeremiah 29. Isn't it great to know that God's got a plan? A plan to do you good. A plan not to bring harm to your life, but to bring you into victory. So today, as you speculate on what does 2015 hold for me, you know what? With God, all things are going to be revealed in due season and due time. All we're called to do is be faithful. I love that scripture that says, you know, do not grow weary in well-doing, but in due season, you'll reap a harvest. I believe 2015 is going to be a time of harvest. I believe that 2015 is going to be a time where God is going to do some tremendous things. I think there's also going to be some bad things happening in our world. Our province of Alberta right now is, is suffering an economic downturn. And uh, that's going to affect people because when, when the uh, oil starts, uh, the prices are low, well, the oil companies, of course, uh, stop production. They don't uh, do the plans anymore, and that kind of affects right across. And a lot of people are a little nervous right now. But if you know the Lord, you know the Lord's your source, and you know that He'll supply every single need according to His riches and glory. What does 2015 hold for us? Whatever God determines. Amen? You just need to come into line with God. My name is Robert Dean Steele. You have yourself a great and godly day.